Good morning everyone and welcome back to another vlog. Gonna do a very mini weekly vlog and for those that are old school, don't get your hopes too high. I'm not gonna do these regularly but I do have a few things in this week. So I'm off to Manchester tomorrow for an event with a company called Very Nico who are the company that very kindly sent me the Disney lounge fly bags recently and I've not met them in person yet. They invited me. It's this really lovely event in, London, in Manchester. Um, it's like a frozen hoop uh evening we're watching the film and they're giving us some of their new frozen collection um launches so that'll be lovely and then on wednesday i'm going to london to go to the traverse creator awards because i'm up for best vlog on wednesday night so that is at a venue called the monica and i don't know loads of people going but it will be a really good opportunity for me because they are the same company that i'm going to palmer with next month um i say with i've i've bought a ticket to their traverse 21 week of experiences and conference and stuff like that so um actually i'm going to be booking my midweek experiences today at 12 o'clock so i would normally do a pt session at 10 um but i've got so much to do today and so much i just need to focus on here at home so i've moved my training to thursday and instead i looked on the app to see what I could do if there are any classes really early this morning there was nothing that sort of took my eye but they do have a couple of at-home virtual workouts that they still keep from lockdown last year so there's an at-home pilates starting right now but you just book onto it and then you can pause it and play whenever you want so i thought i'd do that first thing this morning get loads done today then i'm going to take you along for manchester and london and then on friday i've got a call with laura who is my business coach uh, we do our monthly consultancy calls as we're going into november and then in the evening on Friday night, it's my friend Gary's 40th birthday and he's having a party. So that's a very exciting. Not Gary C, if any of you watch YouTube, Gary and Adam. I have two friends called Gary, not to be too confused. I'm in my workout gear. I've got some water and Bonnie Girl's just on the bed chilling for this one. I love my gym so much and I actually was in there yesterday so I don't feel too bad that I'm not like actually going in physically today. Um, but yeah, I just want to do something, get my body moving and then we'll go on a dog walk. Concentration face on. I've got a bend in that supporting knee. My heel is lifted, my toes are pointing. Hi Bonbon. Bon. Would you like to go for a walk? Would you like to go for a walk? I don't mean to disturb your sleep. We can come back here later. Today is the day that our podcast, The Online Offline, is back for season three. So I've just done the promo for that, which is great. Do the collar first. Yes, excited to go out. And let's do your harness. I know, I know, it's so exciting. Go, go, go. <laughs> definitely know don't you that goes over your head right i have to jump on and do quite a lot of work i've got emails podcast to edit my video to edit and i need to pack as well i also have a list of like a hundred other things the window cleaners coming any minute so i've just sort of sorted that out and i've ordered bonnie some food i need to pack her stuff because she'll be going to stay with my mum tomorrow i also want to join in on a twitter chat at quarter past 11 with the traverse team just to hear what they will have to say about the midweek experiences bookings and then at 12 o'clock i need to jump on that and book book the stuff i want so whenever I come to uh, packing anything, I always use my spare bed and I just need to grab a suitcase. I'm definitely gonna need a suitcase and start putting things out on the bed. So start laying it out. I'm currently tinting my brows. It's 8 p.m. Went on a walk with Bon. Benj came home with some lunch for me for tomorrow. Also changed my wheel to my spare because I've got a flat tire and I need to sort that out later this week. I've been replying to some comments. I made a banana bread that's nearly done. I can smell it even upstairs. So I need to go and sort that out. We've had some dinner. I'm going to go and watch the morning show now in bed. Bonnie and Benj are already snuggled up. So that is what I'm going to do. I'm going to take my laptop and do some stuff, do some bits. Good morning, everyone. I just saw the clip from last night when I was tinting my eyebrows. I used the Maybelline Tattoo Brow and this is how they look this morning. Just a little bit more defined and filled in um but it is 7 a.m bonnie's just having her breakfast also i wanted to show you that i made a banana bread last night we had some for a little bit of a dessert and then i packed up half for Ben's to take to work today and then i've got a little bit left as well um i was going to take it on the train with me but i kind of feel like having it for breakfast my alarm is going off upstairs i need to sort that out but it's actually quite a big piece um of banana bread but maybe i'll have half and take the other half with me and um, this is a bbc good food recipe that my friend bianca told me about so 
Yeah, I don't do much baking, but banana bread is obviously super duper easy. So I'm gonna have some of this. Actually, before we eat, I need to lateral flow test up before you do any, before you eat and drink, isn't it? Um, I do my uh, lateral flow, obviously, whenever I travel, go places, hotels, theatres. I've also packed one in my wash bag to do for tomorrow as well. So let's do that first, woo! Right, I think I have everything I need. I've got my suitcase, I've got my little handbag, got my laptop in the back. This has a little thing. I think we're ready. Okay, so it is 20 past nine. My train leaves at quarter to 10. So I'm a little bit early. It's obviously very loud here at Bournemouth train station. I've got the biggest uh, hot chocolate that I could get. I was gonna bring my own mug, my reusable one, and I completely forgot it. I've come to a bit of a quieter spot away from all the crowds down there. I normally go this end or the other far end, but um, I haven't done my hair and makeup yet because there was just no point. I'll do my makeup on the train because I've got four and a half hours to kill. It's a direct train from Bournemouth to Manchester. Uh, I'm also going to play on my Switch and I'm going to do some work because I've got my laptop. And yeah, I've got plenty to keep me busy, but I just figured I'd just do my makeup on the train. I've, I've packed a mirror with me and then I'll do my hair when I get to the hotel because um, I've just got it in a clip. It's almost one o'clock. Good evening everyone, we will surely be arriving into Manchester Piccadilly where this train will be terminating. Okay, so I've just walked 15 minutes from the train station and the event tonight is at a hotel called King Street Townhouse, I believe, and I booked the last room they had. I just figured it was easiest to stay in the hotel. It's a beautiful hotel and it should be here on the left. I don't know what it looks like on the outside. Oh, it's here. King Street Townhouse. Here we go. Okay, so we are in room 42. It's a townhouse, so they have like upper and lower floors. Ooh, wow. Let's put the light on. Okay, haven't quite figured out the lights yet, but wow, that is beautiful. What a lovely room. Oh my God. Okay, let me get my stuff in and we'll figure this out. There we go, figured out the lights, so this room is absolutely massive. It's really beautiful. That bed looks absolutely divine for later as well. How wonderful. Nice big TV so I can watch telly in bed later. Let's have a little look in these doors. Ooh, really nice Nespresso coffee machine. Ooh, there's robes because of the spa. Wow, look how nice the wardrobe is. Oh my gosh, it's lovely. Ooh. I love hotels, guys. Oh my gosh, look at that bar. Oh my God, look at the shower. Wow, this is really nice. And look at me, I do look like I've traveled for five hours, don't I? Oh, wow, beautiful. This is my little outfit for the evening. Because my bag is brown, I just thought I'd go with a brown outfit with some flats. This is a Primark dress, it comes with like a little underskirt and it's nice and floaty and comfortable and the belt was from actually i don't know no idea who cares all right i'm gonna go downstairs and this event like i said yesterday is a collaboration with very nico and disney uk it is to promote their new frozen collection of products i have a very nico discount that i will leave link below for you if you want to buy anything from them they do loads of lounge fly bags and disney bits perfect if you have any trips coming up Today is not sponsored by them. They've not asked me to film or share anything, but I'm obviously going to because who doesn't want to see what it's like? So let's go downstairs and see. Oh, that's Shannon calling. Great. Shannon's with me now. Hi. Look at how massive it is. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I forgot my mini ears. You're I'm so like, like, like the only people who ears. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. But I did bring my lounge fly bag, so it's all good. It's all good. It is cute. So we're just having a drink. Yes, there's a cake. I want cake. Um, we're gonna go get cake and mingle. Good. <laughs> This is so cute! Okay, 
so we were out of the event. It was very lovely, wasn't it? It was really it was, cute. We just chatted all the way through the film. <laughs> We should have probably sat like further at the back. back I know. We, just we were whispering and everyone, everyone was, was chatting. chatting. <laughs> it was fine. Everyone's seen the film. It was really nice. It was a really nice event. It was just lovely to meet the. Oh, we're going past people. So awkward. <laughs> so. Um, <laughs> it was very lovely to meet the very Nico team. And yeah, it was, so nice. yeah, it was just nice. Mama let her hair down here. <laughs> Two Come on out. <laughs> but we're going to go and um, meet some friends now. And you can be reunited with Buzz. I know. My baby. Baby. <laughs> and we're all going out for dinner. So if I don't vlog too much, then that's why. Although we have eaten food at the place, but yeah, there's mini burgers. Room for Jack Daniel's chicken. Strip. Never say no. <laughs> <laughs> Never say no. I've just come back to my room, and oh my god, there's a little welcome plate with some chocolates. That's so nice. How lovely. So I'm just running myself a bath. It's like half past nine and I had the loveliest evening with some of our friends. Two of the girls I hadn't met before, Shannon, who you saw. Um, and yeah, it was just lovely. We went to TGI's and we had Buzz, Shannon's little boy as well. And we were there for like, yeah, two hours just chatting. It was so nice. We have so much in common, all of us. And now, yeah, I'm back and I'm just catching up with all my messages. So I'm gonna get in the bath, reply to my messages, have a chat with Benj, and then um, get into bed and eat my chocolate. <laughs> I'm so happy. It is almost 11 p.m. I've had a really big problem with my battery on my phone today. And obviously I know I took like photos and videos this evening, but when I got to the event, I only had 16% battery and it was definitely 75 when I last checked. So I don't know why it's dropped so low. So I'm gonna delete loads of stuff in the background actually. Maybe that's not helping. I am so tired. I need to go and do my skincare and brush my teeth, but I was just chatting to Benj and my mum my friend Megan so I just haven't um I haven't done that yet but yeah I've had such a nice day here and now I'm debating about what I do in the morning like do I go up and try and see the pool at like 7 a.m I'm gonna go down for breakfast in the morning my train leaves at 10 I'm a bit gutted at least so early the shops out there are really nice and I wanted to go to the Trafford Centre there's like loads of places I want to see and do and loads of people sent me recommendations but I'm not here for like a, a, a weekend jolly in Manchester, sadly. I'm just here to do the event and um, go down to London. I'm going to get up and do my skincare and my teeth now and um, I will see you in the morning. Good morning, everyone. I've just put my contact lenses in. It is 7am. We're going to go to the pool. Um, but I slept like an absolute baby. The bed was amazing. Maybe I was just really tired, but I slept really good. Okay, so we've got a spa pool. We've got the ladies. We've got rooftop lounges. Let's just go straight into the spa pool. Let's just see if this... Oh my God. Oh, there's people in there. Okay, there are people in the pool, but oh my God, this is so lovely. This is just dreamy proper spa rooms oh my god oh god we've seen that up good i've been killing some time in this room hoping the pool might become free <laughs> okay so we're gonna go and look at the rooftop lounges oh no it's locked okay maybe not Right, I'm back. I've just got out of the shower. I was going to wait for the sunrise, but um, I've got loads of stuff to do today. My train leaves at 10 a.m. to get down to London, and I do wish I'd booked a later train, but I figured that I wanted to get down to London because I want to get ready for the awards, but then I realised I can't check into my hotel till like three anyway. Maybe it'll be ready early, which would be great if it is. I'm going to do my lateral flow test this morning. I'm going to get ready, and then I'm going to have breakfast downstairs. In fact, I think I might just... I might go for breakfast now while it's quiet. Really quiet in here, but this is the breakfast that's included. So you can pick up to three from here, and then you can have a cooked breakfast. So I think I'm gonna go next wheel, maybe. I don't really want a full English. I have omelette all the time at home. I'll never make myself this, so I'm gonna have that. So I went for an apple juice and a fresh fruit smoothie. Fresh fruit and then some little danishes while I wait for my eggs. Here is my main, the eggs royale, and they keep bringing me like 
unlimited apple juice which is nice because I've had two little smoothies and one of these and it's lovely. That breakfast was absolutely wonderful. The service was good, the quality of all the food was nice. I can't believe it was included. I didn't realise my breakfast was included. Um, but yeah, really sad I can't stay a bit longer actually. would love to come back here with Benj, feel like he would really enjoy this. Bed was massive, super comfy. Um, yeah, really, really nice. So tonight's hotel, we're going to be moving to uh, London, obviously, and we're going to the Double Tree, which is actually the Hilton Double Tree, London Tower Bridge, which is exactly the same hotel that Benj and I stayed in for the Disney event, if any of you watched that vlog. So I'm just packing up my things, and here are the, the bits that were in my goodie bag last night. I've got an Elsa Funko Pop, which is kind of perfect because I have Anna and Olaf already, but I didn't have Elsa, so that's nice. And then these two pieces are part of their new Frozen collection. So we've got this tee that says Head Rush of Fun, and this sweater that says I Love Warm Hugs obviously Olaf so yeah lovely so thank you very much very Nico that's um gonna be lovely to wear right I think I'm almost ready I've just swapped out my mask I've got a fresh one for the journey today it should be about two hours 15 to get down to London I've got my case I'm gonna have to leave my little very Nico goodie bag but and I've left the Funko um box but I obviously have Elsa in there which I know is like a crime for a lot of Funko Pop fans that I'm leaving the box but she's gonna go on my windowsill with Anna and El um, Olaf so anyway I've got my case let's check out go to the train station and move to London for the awards tonight oh good welcome on board this is the Vandy West Coast service to London Euston this is honestly one of the best ideas oh, I ever had just waiting for my game to load. I'm all set up. I even brought my controller with me. I mean, look at this. Okay, oh my gosh. I have just spent the last 40 minutes on tubes, absolutely screwing it up, trying to get from London Euston to Tower Hill. Currently sat in Trinity Square Gardens. My hotel is like just behind those buildings there. And I'm just taking a moment to get a breath because, oh my gosh. This is disgusting. I feel really sweaty. I think I need to pack some blue medical masks for Jenny's like today. It's actually lovely and warm, so I'm grateful for that, but it was hot down there. My room's probably not gonna be ready till three, so I wanted to go to Nando's, but it's a little bit too far of a walk, so I have found a Wagamama's nearby, so I'm just trying to like slightly pull up my tights. I'm gonna go to Wagamama's, I'm gonna have a katsu curry. That will fill me up, just in case I don't get the chance to eat. Okay, so I'm at Wagamama's, it's very noisy in here. I just had a notification to say that my room is ready. Yeah, so I've ordered my katsu curry, so I'm gonna eat this. It's 20 to two, I've got to be at the event at 5 p.m. I ordered a juice, but I thought it was good to maybe drink some more water, so we have both. I might have had to wait a long time today because <laughs> it's so busy, but this was worth it. Yes, yes, yes. All right, this hotel is a little bit more basic, but still very nice. I don't think I've got much of a view this time. If you watched our Disney vlog, you would have seen we had a nice view. No, I've got none this side. <laughs> that's what you get when you pay to be a little bit higher up. You get a bit more of a view, but that's fine. Um, still nice out there, isn't it? Look at it. That is a beautiful building. But yeah, we had a superior room before and this is just a standard one, just because it's just me and I don't need anything fancy. <laughs> I already had fancy yesterday. So anyway, obviously we are going to transform this. Guys, I've just got out of the shower, looked down and I've chipped my toenail varnish on my big toes, both of them and a couple of the other toes. I only did one coat yesterday. No, not yesterday, day before. And obviously it wasn't enough and they look terrible. So I found a super drug that's four minutes away, but I am literally gonna run out and go and get some nail varnish. I'm thinking about going now. So I'll just put my hair back in the, in the clip, wet, and then I'll come back and get ready. But it does mean I've gotta put my tights back on and my dress and everything. <sighs> Annoying, but I'll be really self-conscious otherwise because I'm wearing heels that are open-toed and I don't know, I think, I'm, I, I really doubt anyone's gonna be looking at my feet, obviously, but I will know. And I've got time, it's only three o'clock right now, five past three, so <laughs> let's go. I'm back, it definitely took longer than five minutes to walk there, I got a little bit lost and my maps was struggling to navigate because I was going down all the back roads and oh, 
Anyway, it's been about 25 minutes later and we're back. What a mission. Couldn't get just one thing, could I? So I picked up a L'Oreal lip gloss thing, the nail varnish I needed, a new cloth because they don't have any flannels here, and a couple of brushes that I uh, think I'm going to need that I didn't pack with me. So, yes, good. So I'm going to do my hair first and then my makeup. Um, curtains now. So I'll show you when I'm done. I will actually do more of a like updated hair care routine and showing you more of my Dyson Air app when I've got loads more time but not today because I just got a crack on but I will do that in, upcom in an upcoming vlog. Okay so I did my hair in layers. I'm not quite sure. Oh I'm gonna hairspray it anyway. And I clipped it back under each layer so I have no idea what it looks like, so we're gonna do a bit of a reveal together. And hopefully, it's worked out. Oh, it feels a little bit crusty from the hairspray, but, oh, it will drop a little bit. But, I think that looks good, guys. Can you believe I did that by myself? Okay, I've done my hair, I've done my makeup. This is how it's looking, yeah. I probably could do with a bit more bronzer actually. This is my dress. It's so beautiful. This is a Zara dress I got a couple of years ago for my first cruise, but it's completely lacy on the back. So obviously not wearing a bra. <laughs> and I just love it. I really love it. So it's a midi. I'm not gonna wear any tights. And I'm just gonna put my heels on now. Here is a full length of my outfit with my shoes. I'm ready. I'm actually going to take this little tote bag with some spare shoes, flats to walk home in. Home is in back to the hotel, obviously. It took me a minute to try and find the venue, but this is it. Oh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy So I've just come down to the cloakroom area I've made lovely friends, I've chatted to loads of people I've got a nice drink and it's now 7 o'clock So I've been here 2 hours 5 till 7 was the networking bit and now 7 till 8.30 I think is more like food and everyone's here now and then at 8.30 they announce the awards and they'll go through all the different categories. I'm really nervous, I don't think I've got it but if I have I'll be really chuffed but if I haven't I'm just really happy to be here and meet people that I'm going to be spending a whole week in Parma with so this is a really good opportunity. I also met Chelsea from Cheap Holiday Expert on Instagram, I started following her recently and I love her so I had a little fangirl moment because I think she's fabulous. Um, and my friend Shu is here from Deja Shu, my other friend Kirsty, Kirsty Leanne. Kirsty, I actually did go on my last Palmer trip with, not to be too confused, and she'll be on the next one as well. Um, yeah, and I've met loads of other lovely, lo lovely people. You could be the part where it all begins. You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of It's cheap. is not a very nice light but uh, I'm back in my hotel it's half past ten I am absolutely exhausted I think the event is going on till half eleven but honestly I couldn't bear to be in my heels anymore my feet are killing me I think I need to get some of those flats that roll up and you put in your bag I did I did bring my flats with me but they didn't match my outfit and I didn't want to compromise on looking nice so so la vie. but anyway, I did not win the award tonight. Flying the Nest won the award, and actually, I have been on a press trip with them. Even though they live in Australia, I have been on a trip with them in Croatia, and they are the loveliest couple, and they do amazing travel vlogs, so really pleased for them that they won. And it was just a really lovely atmosphere, really lovely to see so many people win and meet some new friends and new faces, and I met loads of people who are going to be at the Palmer traverse 21 trip next month so it was well worth going for me um and i'm just so grateful to be nominated that's two award nominations i've had this year and i'm just so chuffed so yes i'm really really exhausted i've done lots of chatting and 
I just, I ache everywhere, you know, like everywhere aches and I'm just pooped. I'm so sleepy. So my train leaves at half nine in the morning and I've got breakfast included in my room. So I'm going to have to get up fairly early to pack up my things. Good morning, everyone. It's half past seven and I am absolutely exhausted. I'm wearing my backup dress home because I didn't have anything else really to wear. I've packed up all my stuff and I'm ready to go. It's eight o'clock, my train is at half nine. It's probably gonna take half an hour in an Uber. I'm not doing tubes today, no. I couldn't talk because it was so quiet on the train, but I had first class on the way home because it was like three pound extra and I ended up just working obviously, and then got home. Okay, so I have picked up Bonnie. She is in the boot, and she is so loved and looked after at my mum's house. And I'm now gonna go home, and I think I want a bath. I did quite a lot of emails and work on the train, which is great. Which, by the way, that first class seat on the train was really nice. I couldn't really um, talk, because it was so quiet, and there were only two other people in the carriage, but they had the uh, wireless charging on the tables for iPhones, which was even better. I didn't even have to plug in my phone I was so optimistic in my head that I'd have the whole afternoon to like get loads done and go to, to the gym and God, I feel just and I don't know if it is partly maybe a bit of a hangover like I didn't drink that much Okay, I had quite a few drinks. It has been a fair few hours and I have not updated you had dinner with Benj this afternoon I had a nap on the sofa with Bonnie then I did quite a lot of work, uploaded a new video, replied to all the comments, went on a live stream with my friends Gary and Adam. Ben just been down the driving range with a friend tonight, so it's just been the two of us, and obviously I was live streaming. What is it, 2018? Because <laughs> I'm doing weekly vlog. Yeah, I said to him, don't get the hopes up. It's just because I had quite a few days I wanted to share, you know? That's cool. But you haven't been on vlog for a while because you were poorly, but you're better now. I am. I horrible. Look at his dressing gown. <laughs> Sorry, it's just so cute. This is a gift from Christy a couple of years ago. And you've been to the drying range tonight, is what I'm saying. I have been with, to the drying range with my friend Will. Mm -hmm. On Tuesday, I went bowling with my friend Sean and Good Tom. Away, yeah. That's fun. Last night, I played football manager. <laughs> that's just come out. Honestly, it's been it's horrible <laughs> with you, but with you away. <laughs> I just, <laughs> He's loved it. It's been a struggle. It's, it's been, been a really struggle. struggle, yeah. And now we get to spend lots of time together all weekend. <laughs> Actually, no. Rude. No, you're busy no. all day Saturday. Because I'm playing golf Saturday morning. Yes. And then I'm going to watch the cricket. Yeah. And then I'm going to watch Bournemouth against Reading in the evening. Yeah, with a friend. And then you're staying at his house. And then I'm staying at his house yeah. in Basingstoke. And then, yeah, busy boy. So, yeah, we won't see you much. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm going to carry on vlogging a little bit tomorrow and then I'll wrap the vlog up because we will vlog again on Sunday so they can chat to you, see more. You can chat to more then on Sunday. But yeah. Wow, lucky you. <laughs> the chalice. So rude. Anyway, I'm going to go brush my teeth, get my pyjamas on. Ben just, just put Bonnie to bed and um, need some more water. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Benji left for work ridiculous hour and normally I say goodbye to him have a good day give him a kiss I don't remember him leaving I must have been so zonked I slept really bad again like oh, I just feel so tired I kept um getting pins and needles in my arm so I would like sleep too long on one side and then it would go completely numb and I'd just lie there like come on come back <laughs> it's bizarre so it's my friend Gary's birthday today so I need to wish him a happy happy birthday and we're going to his birthday party today. This morning from nine till about one, I have a call with my business coach, Laura. It's the end of the month. We're gonna do our monthly review. We're gonna talk about November. It's gonna be really busy in November because I've got quite a lot of brand collaborations going on, videos I want to do, and I'm going away on holiday, as you know. Oh, look at you sleeping with your pumpkin. Good girl. Very good girl. Okay, it's 12 o'clock and I'm just on a little break with my call with Laura. We're just planning out all my November content and there's so many videos and things coming, so hopefully you'll enjoy that. But yeah, there's just so much to try and logistically work out with contracts, briefs, dates, deadlines, and then timelines. So when I film something, when I send it for approval, when it goes live, 
creating content reports, sending insights to brands. Like there's loads of things that go on um, from start to finish. And today is like a big planning meeting. So anyway, we're on a 20 minute break. I'm just waiting for Bonnie to do her business. But yeah, I just feel, I feel really like overwhelmed with stuff going on right now. This is so much, um, but it's all good. I have Laura helping me. Today has been so busy. Laura and I ended up chatting for maybe an hour and a half, two hours longer than we normally would, just because I have so much going on and I didn't realize quite how much I had going on. Oh, Bonnie and I have just come back from a walk. It was actually quite nice outside and there was some soup in the fridge, so I've just shoved that in the microwave. I'm absolutely starving. It's like three o'clock almost, is it? Yeah, 10 to three. Okay, I am ready now. I am wearing this polka dot silky shirt that was very old from Topshop. And then I'm wearing a little denim skirt as well with tights and I've just popped a little hairband in. So yeah, Bench has just walked Bonnie and he's doing the dinner. I still have so much work to carry on with. So I'm gonna do that until we have to leave and eat. Um, and then, yeah, we'll be going out for a few hours just to go celebrate and wish my lovely friend Gary a happy birthday, actually would be good if I wrapped his present, wouldn't it? I'm gonna do that next, actually. But I just wanted to say thank you for watching this weekly vlog. Obviously, like I said, I won't be doing these regularly. I just thought you'd really enjoy coming along with me for the week. I do have so many amazing fun videos coming up this month. We've got a couple of London trips, so make sure you follow me on Instagram as well. I'm at BroganTateXO. And of course, I've got Palmer at the end of the month, so there'll be Palmer vlogs, pack with me's, so many things. So please subscribe if you're not ready. And I will see you again very, very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.